So in my last swimsuit haul, y'all said you wanted to see some more affordable suits. So today, I got you. Let's do an affordable swimsuit haul. Let's get into it. <laughs> First, it is for my girlies that sunburn and me, because apparently I sunburn a lot. Did you see my Calabra video? Because literally I was like burnt to a crisp at the end. But this is from Old Navy. I love their ruched high rise bottoms. I buy them every year. They're super comfortable. So we have this in like a pretty corn blue. And then look at this rash guard. How cute is this? So it's like a flat front crew neck, but then there's this fun cutout in the back. Now, my thought on this is, is that you'd want to wear a swim top underneath it. I didn't buy one for this haul, but the reason I would wear a swim top is just that's going to give you that coverage. If you did it in the same cornflower blue, which we will link, it'll make sure that you don't get a burnt patch there. But I love this for just like splishing and splashing in the sun and not getting burnt because red is not a cute color. <laughs> I mean, it's a cute color, but not for your skin. Of all the Old Navy bottoms, this one like sucks you in the most. Like it feels like it is so supported. It's almost like wearing compression leggings, but just, just in the underwear. I like it. Uh, the top is very comfortable and I'm surprised by how much I like this combo. Uh, it feels very South of France. <laughs> Bougie on a budget. <laughs> Next from Old Navy, I absolutely love this suit. Okay, first... It's the piping for me, darling. It has this like sporty bottom with this blue piping, more high cut, you know, to give you that long leg. And then with it is this top, and this is what I love. I love a good zipper situation where you can just be like, I am reformed and classy, but I'm also a little bit trashy. It's like an easy way to make something unsexy, super sexy. I mean, let's be real. If you're wearing this swimsuit, you're gonna look fabulous either way, but you get to show as much goodies as you want to show, which I like. I like options. So these are definitely lower rise than I anticipated, but I don't hate them. I still feel <laughs> pretty supported. I don't know what the dance move was, but I was trying to get them to like wiggle down to show you, but they're like, they're up there. They're going to stay up even though they are lower. So they're, they're glitter approved. Okay. So also from Old Navy, we got a couple in there from each brand. Don't worry. It's not all just an Old Navy. But I loved this tile top. I love a good tube top. I love the style of tie up here. I love that it's got like the plastic. I don't know what this stuff is called, but the stuff that like to your skin so it doesn't like, you know, fall up and down with too much jiggling. And then it, you can also like tie it tighter if you need to here. This is adjustable. And then we just have a normal kind of cut bottom. Ooh. This is a flat front version of their high waist. So just like the corn blue one we looked at, except without the ruching. So you get to see what both options look like. So this almost has as much coverage as a tankini. And I love the color. I think it really makes my eyes pop. So I'm a very big fan of this one. Now we're going to go to Target because Target always has cute suits. This is the first one I grabbed. It's a one piece, which is a little unusual for me, but I loved that this was sparkly green. It's this great like foresty evergreen, which I love. And then again, I love a good adjustable kind of keyhole moment here. So you can choose how much of this sacred zone you want. I mean, show it all in my opinion. It's, I don't know, it's like random skin, who cares? It does have a pretty full coverage butt and front. So yeah, it's a pretty modest suit with giving you like a little zhuzh in the boobalas. And this is a masterclass and why I, as a tall girl, do not typically wear one pieces because this is what happens. This should be here. It should be here, but it's here. And so I get this nice, beautiful cutout that really should be like here, right on my stomach. And I am like, two seconds away from everything coming out of the suit at the bottom. Yeah, I don't wear bikinis because I'm brazenly showing my stomach. I wear bikinis because I'm tall and my torso is too long for one pieces and Durand. This is our sexiest suit in this haul. I'm gonna be real with you. It is not my style. I like more support in the front because I tend to like dance and be active when I'm swimming, but lots of you just like to lay in the sun and there's nothing wrong with that. And if you want something that's a little bit less supportive and more optimal for getting those summer rays, this is definitely the suit. Here's the reason I love it. It is reversible. So it's two suits in one and you can mix and match. 
love the orange ties. Personally, I'm partial to the orange and blue, so that's what I'm trying on. It's a triangle top, but it's not a triangle top that like ugh, pulls your neck down like this. I hate that. It actually has a little um, way that it's sewn in here, so it's like a cross strap. And it's gonna give you the same support of tying at your neck without all the like pressure and pain on the back of your neck. So I thought this was a really cute design. It's from Wild Fable, and again, it is reversible, so two suits in one. Okay, usually I hate how these types of suits look on me, but I actually really like this one, um, which is kind of sending me in a little bit of a mind trip right now because I had one very expected opinion of this and I got the opposite. I actually, I kind of like how it looks. So yeah, another suit from Target I loved was this white eyelet suit. We've seen a lot of eyelet this season, so it's very on trend. We've got the cool like puff sleeves. So this is very like Bridgerton-esque. And this is great if you're getting married. I wanted to have an option in here for those of you who might be getting married and are looking for a white suit for your bachelorette party or your honeymoon, or maybe you're getting married on the beach and you want to wear a swimsuit to get married in. This is a cute ass suit for that. It's really well made too, like feeling it. And I just, I love this little design. It's also adjustable here in the back so you can fit it to whatever your bust might be. Like for example, I tend to have a smaller band here, uh, so I can just put it in there. And you would think that it was my boobs that were making this bigger. No, it's my, it's my rolls on the side, but we'll pretend they're boobs. That's fun. <laughs> it's sad, but also fun. Go into the chapel and I'm not gonna get married, but if I was, I would definitely wear this for my bachelorette party. This suit is from Amazon, and I'll be honest, I should have had more suits from Amazon. I just forgot to order more. The bottom is like a standard ruche brief, and the top is a flounce suit. And I put this in this haul because I was thinking pride. Some of you are looking for rainbow fantastic suits. This is a super affordable one that honestly you could wear the top just as a real top versus as a swimsuit. It's very comfortable and it's rainbow fantastic. I love it, I think it's super cute. So this one is very fun. I don't know how I feel about this like triangle piece, but I think it could also be cute like tied, maybe? I don't know. I feel like this looks better on a girl with like a bigger chest where this is like up a little bit more and here it's just like a, but I don't know, scarf tie tops are also in style right now, so maybe this is it. Maybe it says this is just in fashion and I am old. So our last suit from Target is this pink and orange and I guess yellow number. This is a standard cut suit from Kona Soul. And I just like the print. I thought the print was really cool. This is obviously up my alley. This does have a cup, but not an underwire. I am not an underwire swimsuit fan. I know those of you with more of these like an underwire, but personally, I like my boobs to be free. I like titty freedom when I swim. Like, hooray! Let us enjoy the world free from our cage. Um, so these, I don't even like these, <laughs> but I will deal with them. Um, this looks like it's gonna work for me. Might be a little bit big in the cup, cause again, I ain't got much to free in the uh, in the boobola area. I love how high-waisted and how supportive these bottoms are. I would totally wear this all day because I just feel like I've got the support to like live a little in it. Next, we have two suits from Boohoo. I'm a little skeptical on these. I've not tried them on. The first is this. This looks too big. Woo, we will see. We will try it on for science. So I got a 22-24 in these. Um, and it's a purple suit. I'm going to be real with you guys. Don't buy this suit. I'll try it on for you. If you want to buy a cheap suit, you can buy it. But I'm looking at this. Oh, this is going to take forever to dry. This is not good swimsuit material. This is a terrible suit. Do not buy this suit. This is incredibly poorly made. <laughs> also, it smells. And I haven't had something smell this bad in a while. I also want to show you this. So there's a lining. And the lining is significantly smaller than the swimsuit. So I can do this, which your suit should not do. And when that gets wet, it's only going to expand. So this is trash. Do not buy it. I'm not even going to model it next to it because this does not deserve the time. Out. Trash. This is also from Boohoo. A little less crappy. Um, actually, yeah, it doesn't have lining, but I don't think it needs it because it's black. I can't see through the material, which is great. There is mesh. Not that whatever that weird stuff was on the middle of that suit. That suit was bizarre. 
This has a nice mesh lighting, which is also gonna like offer some support in the stomach region. It has over the shoulder straps that are adjustable and then this ties around the neck. So yeah, I would recommend this one, just the purple one, do not waste your money. Um, ties at the top, looks pretty full coverage, pretty well sized, so it's a cute suit, pretty basic, but sometimes you just want a sexy black suit and this one definitely fits the bill. Okay, so this one piece definitely works a lot better. It's still a little short, but since it has this long line here, it's okay. Like it doesn't look totally off like the other one did. So I would still wear this one. I would even wear this one as like a top with a skirt. Um, Cause I really love like this line up. I think it's very sexy. Last, but definitely not least, we have an orange swimsuit. This is from we are, we wear, but I got it from ASOS and I'm putting this suit in here because ASOS has a ton of suits right now. I just didn't order them and <laughs> I wanted to give you another brand, yet another one that you can shop at and get affordable suits. So this is a one shoulder orange ruching two piece and the bottoms ruch up too. I think I should just go like way ham and be like the sexiest suit on the planet when I try this on. Be like ba -ba -ba bam, 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 but I love the color orange. I would pretty much only wear orange swimsuits if I didn't run a fashion channel because look at me. Look at me in the color orange. It's fantastical. Yeah, so I just love them. And honestly, ASOS is a brand I typically buy suits from every year and have never had any issues with. I actually had a We Are We Wear suit in my last swimsuit haul in Puerto Rico. If you haven't watched that, there's a link here. Their suits are fantastic. They are somewhat cheaper on ASOS, and I don't know if that's because they're creating suits specially for ASOS or because maybe those suits are older in the season. I don't know, but either way, if you're looking for a cheaper way to buy them, you can buy them on ASOS, but I would recommend buying directly from them because they are a small women-owned business and they deserve our money probably more than a faceless corporation. Should I say that? Mm. Eh, I said it. I said it. We're giving all of our real opinions today. Like literally, who is the face of ASOS? Who is ASOS? Who is Mr. ASOS? I demand you show yourself. Literally, I have no clue who invented ASOS. I have no clue who that man is. I guarantee it's a man because men always be making money off of women. And there we are. I feel like this is a suit that cool people wear. Like, I don't know if I have enough street cred to wear this, but I kind of love it. I love all the ties. I'm like a big present. Come and unwrap me. I didn't intend to end this haul on a political note, but look at your girl. She's feisty today. But anyway, I wanted to show you that there are great suits at great price points too. So if you didn't find anything in the last couple swimsuit videos I've done, hopefully you found something in this haul or at least brands to check out. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Links to everything are down in the description as usual. As usual, as usual, I'll check you later and...